Um, now, let's talk here about the, <laughs> the, the different campaign strategies. Yeah. Because what, I, what, I'm, what I'm fascinated to see is the lessons learnt or not learnt out of 2019. If tomorrow we see, or the, this week, we see Albo doing one appearance a day, um, going up to an obviously unionised workforce, mm. um, and then that's it for the day, they've learnt nothing. You would think that a bloke who's 10 points in front could walk into any shopping centre in Australia and cop high fives everywhere, but I think you and I both know that he might get some high fives, he might get some people yelling, but he'll get most people going, excuse me, mate, can you get out of the way? I want to go over there. Yeah, he needs to introduce himself to people. People simply don't know who he is. If they, if they do know him, uh, they maybe don't like him so much, and that's what we can see in the polls. Now, uh, Anthony Albanese is going to Tasmania tomorrow. They obviously think they can pick up a couple of seats there, but he was rattled this week in Perth while he was accosted by a heckler. He didn't know how to handle it. And he then didn't told handle lies it about well. the heckler. Exactly. But also, as Michael Kroger pointed out, that he has made a few mistakes in his messaging as well. So he needs to be energetic. He needs to be clear. He needs to do everything he did, uh, didn't do today. <laughs> uh, so none of that. Whatever we saw today is not going to work. Message discipline, because he needs to be so clear. The government has a, can run a double message because they've got Barnaby Joyce. They can run a message in Queensland Correct. and they can run a message for the rest of the country. That is not something that Labor has. Still, we should know at this point, the starter's gun has been fired. What does he stand for? What's the first thing he wants to do when he's Prime Minister? Uh, you can't answer those questions. Also, what, what about the, the this sort of dual advertising strategy, right? Yeah. Which is the, the D. Madigan ads, and obviously Dean's, Dean's been on the show, I quite like it, and she's a you know, tough operator. She's basically running the, the, the greatest hits of Twitter sledges, right? The hoses and the races and all this stuff mm. that, to be honest, I don't think resonates with anyone outside of that sort of media circle and too many times today Albanese was talking to reporters about he was playing he wasn't playing to the people watching he was playing to the people uh, reporting bad move um but secondly then you've got this message of um uh, aged care we care medicare mm. um I know that you can run both messages, but the only way Labor gets to power is by going super negative and running the hate campaign. I just don't know that the hate campaign they are launching in the way they have launched is half as effective as they think it is when they're sitting around high-fiving themselves because they remember all of the little things that it represents. Well, I don't think it's much of a hate campaign. They need a scare campaign. You know, they can run a hate campaign on personality. That's only going to work uh, so much. Well, they tried that cuts bullshit today, and that's not true. Well, well, or out of the budget. Are they still doing that? Yeah, yeah but there was today. The, today the column, talked, the talked column about, thing. Yeah, the column. The budget. Of moving, yeah, of moving from announced to not announced to announced. Oh, what a Look, cut. I think they might go back to the Medicare well. Uh, they went Last time it was uh, they're going to privatise Medicare. This is you don't quite believe that the Liberals have your uh, best interest at heart when it comes to our health system. I, I think they'll wait till they do a big health announcement. There's more on aged care to come and maybe they just focus around that. But after the pandemic, Pandemic, uh, Paul, I also think that voters know the clear distinction between state and mm. federal responsibilities now. So going hard on health, I mean, you're just running a health budget. You're not actually running anything. So whether that works, I don't know. But that double message, I don't know how they get over that. Um, the, 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 the Nats and the Libs are able to run. 